All right, Larry, look what we just got in, buddy. New for 2024. This is the Dutchman Voltage V Series. V Series? 30, yeah, 3,800. Wow. So this is going to have a great big garage on it. So we'll get around to that. But um, we just got this thing in. Um, so let's start out here and we'll walk around, Larry. So as you see, it's got the nice lights up front here. That is pretty cool. Also with Dutchman, you're going to get a one year and a three year. So the three year is going to be your structural warranty, as you see. Another cool thing with this, you're going to get the Kurt, Kurt Rotoflex hitch. So that helps with your chucking going down the road. And this is pretty cool too, where you got like a little mirror right here. So when you're backing up, it helps you line up oh, it makes with sense. the hitch, you know? But check this out, buddy. Good old Cummins O Nan. There you go. 5,500 on board. <laughs> Hit a button, you're ready to go. Let the electricity go out. You're still going to have power where nobody else does. That's right. Come on around here, you'll see that there's slide toppers, Larry, on every slide out. Oh, that's cool. You don't so, have to. Buy them aftermarket. No, so this unit is going to come pretty much with everything you need, even the backup camera on it. So, even the backup camera? Even the backup camera. It's got your auto level on there. So just so people don't get mistaken with the V series, you can get it without auto level, Larry, but I did order this unit with the auto level. It just makes sense. It does. It really yeah. does. Nice pass through. You'll see the aluminum framing in here. Um, real simple unit to hook up. You got your 50 amp plug outlet. Oh, but with 50 amp, it still has three ACs. Three ACs, buddy. Wow. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Your hook up there, spray port here, um, fresh water, and then city water connect. And obviously, you got your other tank. Nice thing here, you got your cable, satellite hookup, your exhaust for your generator. And this also has your 30 gallon. Propane tanks, you got two of them. And as you know, when you buy from us, they're going to be completely filled up. And it also have an uh, Interstate RV Marine battery. Yep. All right, so coming on around here, Larry, this is a nice big slide. Look at this, buddy. You got your own gas pump. Oh, my gosh. So these guys, you know, like me, side-by-sides, -side, dirt bikes, whatever. And that feeds the generator, too, right? Right. Feeds the generator, too. Okay. So... You know, a lot of people say, well, how much gas do I have left? Is there a gauge or something? Of course there is. There's going to be a gauge right here. And this is your start and stop. So you can get your pump going. So you'll hit that. Oh, my it generates God. the pump. Wow. So it pumps out the fuel for you, just like a gas station. Super, super cool. And then walking around here, you'll see that we have the deck down with the anti-skid on it. It has the backup camera like I was talking about up there. Then oh, you also said it's got the two LED lights. Too. Right, I was about to comment on that. So you got your two LED lights that you can shine down. So this ramp will actually lay flat. You just undo the right here the rings. That'll lay completely down. So that way you can get your whatever toys in here. But they also got the back end dovetailed. Dovetailed, so that makes it a lot easier too. Okay. Larry. Plus this is a assist tailgate, so it's real light and easy. I mean, literally, I'm two fingers right now pushing that thing up. Oh, wow. It's that easy, Larry. And you got that screen to pull down. Yeah, I love that. Yeah. Days like today, we got oh, a nice breeze. Perfect. It's about, what, 58 degrees out here. So when we go inside, we'll give them a little taste of how that um, gate comes around. So what that gate will do, it'll walk around here, Larry. And then the cool thing about this unit, most toy haulers, the steps come off the back. Right. So you're going to need another five foot of room. <laughs> so with your tailgate down, the steps come on the side here. Oh. So you walk right up here. And that's your campsite. And that's your campsite. Yeah. So that's nice. Also, with all toy haulers, you're going to have vents. That lets the fumes out so you don't get vents throughout your whole uh, unit. Right. Um, two entrances on this one. Um, I got some nice aluminum rims, too. Beautiful rims on it. You got your marine outdoor speakers. Um, little entertainment center so you can hook up your TV out here and plug it right into your cable. Then also you're going to have a quick connect, Larry, right down here. So you can run a grill from right here and it'll connect right into your propane tank. Excuse tanks. me, Frank. Yep. I don't understand this. You had a black tank flushed on the other side. Right. But you also got one on this side? You got two, yeah, because there's two bathrooms. Ah! Yeah, come on. Oh, go ahead. Right. Yeah, they thought of it all on this one, Larry. But again, like I said, it's really cool. I like this. My unit has it. 
it's nice because you don't have to bring extra tanks with you. You can just plug right in there, run off your propane uh, that's in the unit. This has uh, more ride steps. Same thing with the suspension on there. Oh, also, Larry, on-demand tankless water heater. Oh. How about that? And not only that, we also have solar on board. Okay. So that's really cool, man. I believe it's a 200-watt solar panel. 200-watt solar panel. Okay. Yep. And this sucker he actually tells you temperature outside, too. So I wasn't far off. All right, Larry, before we do go inside, look at this also, Larry. This has your keypad system. So literally, you can put in your code, lock your door. Don't have to carry around the keys. Vice versa, you can unlock it too. Yeah. And then you do have the option with the keys. Yeah, but that's, who that's, wants to carry around keys? Not me. So, all right. Now that we're coming inside, Larry, this is really neat. I like this. So you got a lot of people like booths, a lot of people like tables. So you got a 50-50 here. <laughs> you got a booth and you got your table. So this should appeal to a lot of people. Look at that TV. And this will come out of the way, too. So you can pop that on your way. Okay. Yeah, then you got your TV up there that'll swivel around so you can see. Um, you got all your gauges and stuff right up here. This right up here is going to be for your hours and your fuel for the generator. You got um, the heated tanks. So oh. that's really nice right there. Heat pads on the tanks. Okay. Correct. This also has a solo uh, controller which you also can Bluetooth to your phone and use wow. it. So that's really nice. And then right here is going to be your tankless water heater controller. So everything's right here, right in this area. Not a nice thing. They put a radio in here. You know, Like I always talk about, I'm a fan of just keeping it simple. Give me an old school radio, man. Right. You still can Bluetooth to it. I mean, it's simple. Fireplace? Um, fireplace here. Nice big fireplace. Um, you got nice storage here. Larry. All above here, you got storage. Again, marine speakers on the inside also with ample lighting all the way around this unit. And this couch is so comfortable, Larry. I mean, that sucker right there. You got three recliners right here. And then also their heated massage. Oh. So, I mean, those days you're out there full wheeling or whatever you're doing back there. Those come out here and facts. chill. Yeah. You get jarred around out there. I also like the blackout blinds. Yeah. So, you got easy up blackout blinds, which are really nice. And then over here, and those actually look comfortable, don't they? What's that? Oh, the recliners? I, I sat in those. They are comfortable. Wow. I just don't want to sit down because I might go to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> so then you also have a nice pantry in here, Larry. So, I mean, not a small one, a nice big. What I like about this pantry is you can adjust it. Most of them are fixed. Oh, you can pull it out. So you can pull those out and. You know, so that could be a whole different one. But I also want. like that it's actually a dome light, like in your truck. Yeah. Yep. You open the door, it will turn on. Yeah. Yeah. That is a great feature. And this is really neat, too. You got your own designated kitchen. So they, they made it where it's kind of almost separated, which I like. So basically, when you're cooking, you got counter space here, you got counter space here, over here. So this could be your coffee bar, crock pot, ninja cooker. Right. Big old farm sink. With your two drains, I mean, just super nice, super deep stainless steel, blackout faucet, got your spray port. Above, you're going to have your microwave, nice little oven in here. It's actually bigger than the little teeny ones. Mm -hmm. So you're a little bit and, bigger you oven. Know, I just love the transom windows in the kitchens. Yeah, you know, it right. makes sense. It does. Plus, it makes just feel more roomy or homier to me. But again, Larry, I mean, just storage all over this place. So, I mean, you've got wow. a ton of storage in this unit. I mean, look at the drawers all over. Remotes. And this I like, too, man. So, you can put a trash can, whatever you want, because nothing blocking it right there. Oh, that's what that button was for, that Max Air switch here. Yep. It's for the one in the kitchen. Yep. So, when you're cooking and stuff, it'll vent out. Okay. Which is nice. Um, then also, Larry, since you were over there, I just forgot. Sorry, man. You have to edit No that. problem. Oh, here you go, Larry. Here's one of the ACs. You're talking about three ACs. Yeah. There's one of them. So we got two more to find. One here. So we got one. So we got Don't find tell two. me there's one in the garage. Uh, which, come on, man. Come on out here. So this is nice, too. Look, you got a nice storm door glass that walks oh. right out to my favorite part, the garage. Anti-skid uh, 
matting down here with D-rings to the frame. Is it oil resistant? Oil resistant. Okay. D-rings to the frame, oh, as we all know. Yeah, those are steps. But as we all know, toys do leak. I mean, we ride them hard. We try not to uh, have leaks, but it happens. Um, super cool, Larry. So, couches slash bed. So, in this unit right here, you got two queen beds. One above us and one down here. And they'll come out of your way, obviously, and fold up like this. And I think there's a table that goes in between there. There is, as yep. well. Yep, so there's a table in the back bedroom that you can bring out here. Um, another nice feature, Larry, is this bed system. A lot of them used to be on that rail system. You hit a button with the motor. The only problem with those, they'll, they shake real bad going up and down. And if they break, guess what? Mm. You can't use them. This system right here is almost bulletproof. Pull down. Oh, my gosh. Look at how easy. Pull down, and you're, you're done, buddy. Oh, wow. But not only do you have sleep in here, look above you. You've, no. got, you've got another room up there. Oh, now, the kids will be fighting over that. There. there is a ladder up there. I can't get up there real not right now, but good Lord. Yeah, and also there's vent up there, and there's a window. So and I mean, another AC. There's your AC, buddy. So washer and dryer hookup. It also has... The camera back here so you can watch your toys and stuff it's prepped for one it's prepped for one built in gfi because you got the washer and dryer hook up so a lot of people go frank what's up with this that's I, you know i gotta ask you the same question okay so I'm like okay it has a bathroom but right. it does say stack and pack yep foldable yep bathroom so the reason for this is everybody wants a half bath and they don't want to have to run into their unit when they're done full wheeling or they're done with their dirt bikes getting RV dirty. So the cool thing with this feature is it folds out of the way because we all know these side by sides. It folds. It folds out of the way. And I'm about to demonstrate for you. But as we all know, these side by sides are getting longer and bigger. And golf carts are too. So we want to utilize all the room in this unit. So with a little... And pull right here. Now, guess what? Oh you got all gosh. that room, buddy. And you've got a sink in there. And they even put a D ring all the way over, <laughs> which is awesome. <laughs> so now you can come in here, wash your hands, hot and cold, get them all cleaned up, throw some water on your face, not going to hurt the floor, and then go in there and eat some dinner. So, super cool. One of my favorite units. I mean, I just, you know, I'm a big toy hauler fan. Um, I love the screen back there. I, I mean, think that's pretty cool with the struts on that bed, though. Yeah, I mean, that's just, that's just, the, I mean, literally, there we go. And then just to make sure it's secure, there are pins that you can put up yeah, there. Yeah, there are pins, correct. Okay. Yep. Then you got your pull down blinds in here, so every window is private. Your other vent, too, Larry. So you got two vents in here, so when you have your toys. That is, that is awesome. Yeah, and I mean, literally <laughs> to put it back, I mean, it's really this simple. You're going to pull the pin in, lock it, you're done. Wow. I mean, I think that was 10 seconds. Yeah. But there's more to this unit. We still got a master bedroom and another bathroom. Lord have mercy. I don't know. <laughs> oh, I like that diamond point too right there. That black Oh, look at plate. that refrigerator. Yeah, we didn't even PM this, Mary. Look at this. What is that? Like a 18, 16 foot refrigerator? I think you're right on the money. Yeah. Okay. God, that sucker even feels cool inside. So another nice feature with this too, Larry, see this lock right here? You'll see a little bolt right here. So what this does is when you're going down the road, that'll screw into there and that holds it in place. Oh, that's a lot better than those. Yep. So that's going to go things. right there and it's going to keep your doors from coming open. Okay. So it's right there in the tray and also you got egg holders, which is neat. So you hold a dozen eggs. <laughs> Put on them flying around. Man, I still love that couch, Larry. So we'll walk up the steps here. Another key feature I'm a big fan of, the rail on the wall. I mean, I think every fifth wheel should have that when you got steps. Especially, I mean, these are three steps going up. Three steps, yeah. man. Yeah. So I'm going to let you key in on the bathroom here, Larry. Okay. Got that residential shower. Yep, residential shower. And for those that are vertically challenged, it does have a skylight right where it's needed. Correct. 
Is that a porcelain or? I got your, got your porcelain knocker there. Okay. Then it's got a favorite. I love this butcher block look. Uh -huh. I mean, I just love that, man. That's just a cool look. Then you got your nice medicine cabinet here. You got your overhead fan. Good size, too. You can actually fit something. No, there. that is actually a good size. And even underneath here, none of your pipes are really exposed to get in your way, except, you know, a little flush pipe. But I mean, You got that. Uh, every sink. Every Residential sink. Residential or yeah. RV. Yep. <laughs> but, man, what a nice oh. bathroom. Upgraded shower head, too. It is. I love the black. I like the black. All right, Larry, now we're going to go into the master bedroom. Um, man, you really can walk around in here. Most, they're so tight to the wall that you can't walk around. And here's your third AC, Larry. Wow. So there's your number three. We found them all. That is awesome. That three is. Three ACs. Three ACs. Here's your table that you were talking about for That's the garage. The garage yep. Area. Yep. So obviously it doesn't stay in here. We but just look have at this down. room on this That's side. That's what of the I'm bed. getting at. I mean, normally you can't walk around these things, but each on each side of the bed, you're gonna have plug outlets, USB ports. Got your butcher block. Butcher block on there. Butcher <laughs> block. And then you got your little dome light for reading or whatever you want. But even up here, Larry, we got uh -oh. your struts. Would you like? You know, it just makes I sense. know you love your struts. So <laughs> there's Larry's struts. Might have to start naming them Larry's trucks. <laughs> but I also like how they did a slide in here. Yeah. For your Yeah, so that's giving you some room, room right? Mm -hmm. And again, my butcher bot. But yeah, this is super nice. I mean, you got hanging for your hanging clothes there. Again, over here, you're going to have hanging clothes. They're actually tall enough to where if you wanted to dress right. up one time, you could. You could, yeah. absolutely. Yep. So also, Larry, you know, I was talking about they have, you know, where you can plug in your USB ports and my favorite uh, butcher bot, but there's storage too on both sides. Oh, wow. So you got storage here and storage on that side. Yeah. So a lot of storage in this unit. Plus you have under the bed storage. Oh, yeah, right of now course. Table yeah, there, we're not going to move that, but everybody. And then obviously you got designated thermostat, for, thermostat each for each room. So that's pretty rare because normally it's your main one runs your bedroom, vice versa, you know, when you have three. So all three of them have their own designated thermostat. If I remember right, it's called the Omni Chill yeah. Third AC. So right, yep. Good lord. I know. Then there's your TV right here, right across from the bed. Um, man, and then check this out, Larry. It's got this nice privacy glass, so you don't feel like you're just locked in here because you got the light to it travel does through, but it gives you privacy. Right. But also, it gives you a, kind of more of an open feel too, which I like. I like this uh, grayish. <laughs> color on the on the woodwork yeah you know instead of real dark or, or real or light real you know that white that everybody's using that bright bright white yeah they kind of did a neutral they went in between the dark in between the light and it just came out with a pretty color and um it works well it's like an ash yeah it really works well so i mean this we just got this unit in there and i've got it priced right and we'll show them out here when we go out here buddy okay all right now larry everybody wants to know what in the heck is this thing going to cost me? Well, if you're paying full-blown retail, which we never charge you here, look at that figure. $122,937. We have it on sale right now for $79,900. Wow. I mean, come on, man. It's that time of the year, guys. Let's get out there. Let's have some fun. We're here to help you guys. Plus, we're the dealer with no hidden fees. So right. there are no hidden fees on top of this. We're not going to charge you the freight, the destination, the cleanup. You know, we're a hometown dealer for the hometown people, and we want to help you guys. We teach you. We have technicians that show you how to use these. Plus, you get mine and Larry's personal cell phone. So please look at our reviews, and you'll see why people are buying from us. And come on out and see me and Larry. I'll we appreciate you, what, you all. This is... Yeah. This is a, a home run, right? Yeah. Here. So I want somebody to come take this RV and go have fun with it. Down if at Busco can... or even Hatfield and McCoy's. Well, they just opened Deep Creek again, oh, too, Deep guys. Creek. So I heard Deep Creek's open. So come on. Okay. But you guys come on out and see me and Larry. We're here to help you guys. And there's no pressure. So you just come out, enjoy it with your family, and then uh, we'll write you on up. Thanks, Y'all have Frank. a good one. See ya.